So, there are many things to try. You see here quite clearly that there is a rather big gap between this coil. Uh, this is good for efficiency, but uh, not so much for the top end. Um, yeah, there's a remote on top of there because otherwise it <laughs> falls over. I used one of these uh, piece of PVC gutters. It's really a, a top-notch uh, component to be used. Not really, but I wanted to have these huge radius here. It helps in the um, bevel diffraction. So I still have a, um, a notch at 2.7K. I'm not sure where it, com where it comes from, but I modeled it in um, Edge, which is a program to model uh, bevel diffraction, etc. And mostly comes from just the pure size of the panel itself. So when I measured this uh, it, with the roundovers on the side, it's far less. Now, the one problem that I did not fix right now is that this creates some sort of cavity thing. So either there has to be a lot of foam, and I'm not sure how much it does, but I had this problem earlier with a ribbon. A ribbon that I used with these two sides. So half would be nice probably. So it doesn't wrap around like it does right now. If I remove this, I, I don't know, maybe it falls over. Uh, with the uh, Daytons once more. Uh, and why? Uh, I wanted to check if the uh, measurement I did earlier with the 92 dBs at the current impedance, which is really low, 1 ohm, uh, was true. So I know these drivers are 86.6 .6 and uh, I measured them without any crossover and their most efficient part of the whole woofer was uh, 86 sort of and uh, these did the same when I measured them minus 6 dB so compensating for the uh, impedance that is 1 ohm so it will act like it is a 4 ohm driver same efficiency so yeah they are 86 80, 86.5 86 I don't know so that's good so there's much to gain um, the foil itself is a bit heavy I think it drops off at the like the upper 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 range and could be a little bit better so maybe thinner foil and I wish to close this gap a little bit to make it look like the rest not so much because of looks but it helps and I'm not sure how much you have to cover here. So this piece of wood is sitting just on the edge of what is actually playing or driven. And then behind the wood there is still a piece that is not driven but it acts uh, still with the membrane. I don't know how wide you have to make it. Also this is of course square. If you round this off what would it do? And this of course uh, is also a ridge which is not helping in the frequency response. But it's better than a flat panel. So yeah. There is so much to try. So much to try and so much to model. And I'm not so good in modeling. I said I would not bother you with the tune anymore. But I will. But you're free to skip it. Because uh, yeah, that's rather easy. I'll leash you a bit. Wow, that looks great. Uh, we played this before. Uh, re regular pleasures. Patrice Berber, I guess. My eyes ain't that good. Is this in the middle? Sort of. Uh, oh yeah, I tried a, a, a wider version. Same principle. With, but I did not have the foam on this side yet. Well, I'll try it, but it's not gonna work. So this kind of principle um, works, but only if your panel is not that wide, or at least the, the, the playing part is not that wide. Which is perfectly fine if you want to make line sources. This is 
uh, essentially the ideal construction but it's not so much I thought maybe I'll try it for a wider panel but that's not so much a, a win it's either a lot it's more a loss that panel that white ribbon there even if you use two these will outperform them so while it's using less magnets or the same amount of magnets let me see uh, 12 yeah so less magnets but still uh, this one would outperform it this one would outperform that one if it was flat but it doesn't go as low as this one and it cannot play top hand as well so well it's a balancing act again Let me go louder. I don't know. No. The bass drivers are, of course, small, so. When I walk down the street, let each step that I take be the road repetition of the road yesterday. With a monotonous cadence and a stultifying sameness. Sedate me Let the finest nuance of my day Absolutely not Resonate In lieu of diamonds and ink Why not think commonplace Oh, uh, the... I use 24 to be per octave filter, so... Ribbons are doing almost everything from within a line clock precision and up. unassuming grace. I'll show you. Enlist me, conscript me, fix the patterns in simple grace so I cannot. This is only the tweeters. Differentiate. only the woofers with a lot of um, things resonating. Oh, the same wife. Reliable revulsion for sticky situations in life. Mediocre aspirations, monochromatic and plain. Humdrum complications in the ordinary. Typical tragedies, nothing new nor distinct. Regular pleasures that won't disturb the routine. Procession of the doppelganger days Blur me Obscure me Let a lifetime tick away As I blissfully Somnambulate Take me for granted Honeymoon flags 
jointly wallow in a connubial nap. Drag me softly into existential ennui. Do not surprise me. Do not schedule a thing. If you really want me and you feel this is love, leave me completely stuck. good vibes on these but I have to like understand them yeah I don't because this wider version there does not work this works so apparently you cannot make it too wide then it it fails so that's good to know uh, but I need a little bit more tests for that and also I would like to increase the high end as I told which would we are probably need thinner aluminium I'm also looking for Kalidex, which is a uh, substitute for Mylar, but less noisy, but it's nowhere to be found. Or it's like one meter or something. I don't. I need a few hundred meters if I want to buy something, because otherwise it's kind of useless. I mean, one meter is, is not enough to do anything with. So I ask, uh, I ask to pond if they know an address because it's not like you buy it in a web shop or something I wish it was but not the case I could not find any <clears throat> anyhow um, that's done with a woofer so yeah you can easily make them with a woofer and I have a six no what is it they were 86 and the woofer is 86 but uh, at the low end where the woofers are playing at this moment they're more like 82 dBs efficiency so I got like 4 or 5 dBs um, over if this panel was not a 1 ohm driver so I tried this and then probably I'll make a new foil and I have to think about that because I, I want to use 18 micron aluminium foil which uh, is possible but I need a I need to spray glue, which I hate, and it's also not very easy to do in this contraption at all. Because, well, it's too long of a story, but it's not it's not very handy. Now I can cut it, put the miler on, cut it again, and then I got my foil. Uh, this is not possible uh, unless unless I spray when uh, the foil is still attached to the machine and. Um, as you know, spray glue will go everywhere, so it will end up on all my linear reels, etc. On my machine itself, which is not very nice. So I have to think of something. <laughs> or find thinner aluminium. Which I found, but it's not wide enough. So yeah. Anyhow, uh, I really like the uh, remote on top of the left loudspeaker so it doesn't fall over. That's a nice add-on, I think, and hopefully I can, um, yeah, think of some more nice add-ons. See you later. Bye-bye.